Okay, in Walmarts, you're going to have what we call a pure play. Uh, this is a Mountain Dew pure play, and we also have a Starbucks pure play. Some Walmarts do not have both, they only have one. Um, but same situation here, you want to always uh, start with the QR code. Like I said before, it's on the left. Scan that QR code, fill it, take your order, fill it, and then we go from there. All right, now we're in front of a cooler bank. In a lot of different stores, we have all kinds of variety of these. Some of them have three coolers, five coolers, 10 coolers, and even beyond that. We don't have QR codes for these coolers, but the same principles apply for how we fill them. We're gonna open the cooler, we're gonna shift all the product that's cold to the left side so the consumer has something they can buy that's cold, and then these are also broken down by brand, so we'll be filling them by brand. This is a Gatorade cooler, and that's why we have Bolt 24. You move on to the Lipton, it'll be full of Lipton products. You move on to the Bang, it'll be full of Bang products. And then Pepsi will be full of Pepsi products and so on. Now we're going to the back room. Okay, now we're in the back room. Walk around the back room, find a cart that's laying around that's empty, of course that you want to be able to blow the product on and take it to the front of the store to fill the coolers. I've got my list, so now all I gotta do is get the product and load it. Some of our product could be in a shrink wrap film like this, or some of it could be in a case like this. So now I'm just gonna grab the product that we need, load it on the cart. Now we're going to roll it to the front and start filling the coolers.